Most people hadn't heard of Erling Haaland three years ago. Now he's one of the best young players in world football. Here are 10 things you didn't know about the man everyone wants to sign. 10. Copied Cristiano's diet World-class footballers have one thing in common – dedication to their craft. Getting things right off the field is the key to producing the goods on the field. Haaland is no different. The Borussia Dortmund striker has taken inspiration from one of the goats, Cristiano Ronaldo, by copying his diet. Haaland's dad confirmed in 2020 that his son eats the same foods as Cristiano so he can be at the top of the game. Ronaldo eats six meals a day and never uses salt. He often eats pasta and chicken. And one went to a restaurant with Patrice Evra and only ordered fish. Haaland's taken a leaf out of CR7's book. 9. Could have played for England At the tender age of 20, Haaland is already the star man for Norway's national team. But if things had turned out differently, he could have been playing alongside Harry Kane at international level. Haaland was born in the English city of Leeds in the summer of 2000. He moved to Norway with his parents when he was three. But his birthplace means he could have played for England. He might have left Leeds before he started school, but Haaland still has a connection with the city. I want to be the best possible, he said in 2017. The dream is to win the Premier League with Leeds. Watch this space. 8. Scored 9 in one game Let's be honest, Haaland's numbers are ridiculous. He scored 29 goals in 27 games for Red Bull Salzburg. In his first season and a half at Dortmund, he scored 57 in 59. In his first 12 caps for Norway, he found the net seven times. But his most impressive feat so far came at youth level for the national team. In a game against Honduras at the Under-20s World Cup, Haaland scored an extraordinary nine goals as Norway won 12-0. That was the only game he scored in, and Norway were knocked out in the group phase, but Haaland still won the golden boot. Jose Luis Rodriguez, an agent for several Honduras players, was there that day, but Haaland told me I was annoyed because I could have scored 11 goals, he said afterwards. He's a machine. 7. May debut aged 15 Haaland was an amazing football talent almost as soon as he could walk. He joined the academy of his local team, Bryn, aged five. Ten years later, he made his senior debut for the club. Not many players play their first professional match at such a young age. But as we know, Haaland isn't just any old footballer. He actually started out wide for Bryn, but his coach moved him up front pretty quickly. It was a good decision. Haaland played well and was soon signed by Mould, Norway's biggest club. And who was Mould's manager, we hear you cry? None other than Oli Gunnar Solskjaer. 6. World-beating jumper Holland is technically gifted and a wonderful finisher, but he also excels at the physical side of the game. The Dortmund star is 6 foot 4 inches tall and has a well-built frame. He's also deceptively quick, much more so than other players of his size. He bullies centre-backs with his pace, power and strength. Haaland's an incredible all-round athlete, and he has been since a young age. When he was five, he produced a standing jump of 1.63 metres. That set a new world record at the time, and it still hasn't been beaten 15 years on. Way to go, Erling! His idol is Zlatan. Haaland no doubt has his eyes on the Ballon d'Or, even at just 20 years old. He'll believe he's good enough to win it in the future. If he does, he'll surpass his idol Zlatan Ibrahimovic. The Swedish striker has never been voted the world's best player, but Zlatan is the player Haaland's always looked up to. I had a lot of role models, and I've seen many good players, but Zlatan Ibrahimovic is the biggest one for me. How he became so good, the path he took, the way he plays. Ibrahimovic's longevity is remarkable. He he made his professional debut before Haaland was born, and he's still banging in the goals in 2021. If Haaland does the same, that means he'll still be troubling goalkeepers in the 2040s. 4. His dad was a footballer Now, the reason Haaland was born in Leeds is because his dad was playing for Leeds United at the time. Alfinger Haaland was a defender and midfielder. He played 181 games in the Premier League for Nottingham Forest, Leeds and Manchester City. He's most famous for his feud with Roy Keane. Haaland accused Keane of feigning injury in 1997 when the Man United man had actually ruptured his ACL. Keane never forgot the incident. Four years later, he was sent off for a horror tackle on Haaland's knee. I wanted to hurt him, but I had no wish to injure him, Keane said. 3. His mum was an athlete too 
Parlin comes from a sporting family. Just like his dad, his mum was also a professional athlete. Her sport wasn't football, though. Gri Marita Braut was a national heptathlon champion in Norway. Maybe that's why Erling can jump so far. That's not where the sporting success ends, though. Erling has a cousin, Albert Tjarland, who plays for Mold's youth team. By March 2021, Tjarland had scored 64 goals in 37 matches. Imagine him and Haaland up front for Norway. They could be world champions. 2. Champions League Alarm Clock Haaland has already made waves in the Champions League. The striker's desperate to get his hands on the trophy one day. He loves the Champions League so much that he has the anthem as his alarm clock. I wake up to it every day, he said. It's the last song I'm tired of. I always get a perfect start to the day. 1. Nicknamed Manchild Haaland is absolutely massive. Now, that's not because of a recent growth spurt. The Dortmund striker has always been huge. When he was playing for Mould as a teenager, his teammates called him Manchild. With his baby face and burly frame, it's a fitting nickname. Former Mould captain Ruben Gabrielsen has explained what it was like playing against a young Haaland in training. He was so big. He was a different animal. He was killing everybody in training. We just started laughing and it was like, who is this guy? Everyone in the football world knows who he is now. Will Erling Haaland win the Ballon d'Or one day? Let us know what you think in the comments section and don't forget to hit subscribe.